what's up guys, it's Double, and we are back with some more of our Spore playthrough, and a few things before we get into this session, uh, for one, my game didn't save, so I had to go back and redo everything that we did last time all over again, and for whatever reason, this time around, the Blue Nation refused to become my ally, so I had to conquer them, um, because they just kept attacking me. So that took a little bit of time, but it did end up getting back to where we were, and I have redone our spaceship. I know I am bad at building, you guys let me know, I understand this, I am not good at building things, but I have redone it, uh, I'll show you what it looks like. I did go with the X-Wing theme because I thought that was a good idea, so I have the, uh, the X-Wing going on here, the guns on each uh, wing tip, and I have the four thrusters on the back. Um, that's as close as I could get it to the X-Wing, and I put a bunch of things on here that aren't on it, um, just for, uh, added guns, because most of you guys wanted me to add a bunch of guns on here. I didn't want to overdo it, because I thought it might look silly if I just had a bunch of big guns on here, just, like, just chunk it up the thing like that. <laughs> Actually, that's not too bad. Wow! <laughs> but, um, it might look a bit silly. I kind of want to make it, um, sort of, sort of cool and not silly this time around. Most of the things I built have been fairly silly, so I'm gonna make it normal size, and, um, another thing, um, a lot of you guys are saying that you don't like the space stage, it's very boring, um, I'm gonna try and make it as fun for myself as possible, because if I'm having a fun time, I hope you guys will have a fun time watching, um, so I'm just gonna kind of jerk around a little bit, and not really, uh, I mean, I'm gonna try and get all the, uh, the objectives done and stuff, but I'm gonna have a, a good time doing it, of course, and, um, I am using the Galactic Adventures DLC, I don't really know what this adds, so if you guys want to let me know, feel free to go ahead and do that, because I'm not sure what it even does. Um, a bunch of you guys were saying, get that DLC. Um, I do have it already, so uh, let's go. Uh, I'm going to jump right back in here. Um, I am on the same quest that we were last time, uh, which was to get rid of those guys with the laser beams, so I'm going to do that. Like, the mini laser costs ener- oh, costs energy, really? We have an ener- it's like our mana bar, sort of, even though it's energy. So we're gonna do this. I mean, I'm, I'm pretty, I'm actually looking forward to this, especially now that we have like a cool looking spaceship. Wow, that's actually really, oh, I haven't really flown it yet. Woo! Okay, I should probably get rid of this affection uh, because things are gonna start spreading and getting out of control. Bam, whoa! That is awesome, holy crap. I can just fly through trees. Trees do not affect me, guys. I'm trying to, I can't really see them. Stop infecting others. I'm trying to get... I don't want to kill anyone else. Wow, this thing is strong. Where's the other guys? This guy, he's just alone. He's like, I accept my... Oh, he's not. Whoop. There we go, we got him. Holy shit! Oh yeah, I didn't kill this guy. Woo! Is he gonna attack me? Whoa! Okay, yes he is. I'm not gonna do that. I probably should have killed him before I moved forward. I just was really impatient with those blue nation. They were just... Being such assholes. Anyway, let's go forward here and do what we gotta do. Did they get him? What's this? Open your communications. Ah, bah, bah. What do we got going on? Laudable job. You're the right stuff. Hey, I'm the right stuff. You've earned your home world's respect and confidence. We want you to pilot the spaceship and lead our race forward. And wow, I was one away from being able to save. That's annoying. Uh, galactic exploration and glory. You've earned the badge and title of captain. Our scientists have developed an interplanetary di drive for your ship, but you'll need to install it first, Captain. Sounds good. I'm ready. Use the trade panel to buy and sell tools, spice, and rares. Uh, items from your cargo that can be sold will appear at the bottom of the trade panel. This is getting complicated, guys. Uh, click on the items in the trade panel you wish to buy and sell. Um, also, I'm just going to go ahead and say, I am bad at this game, I know this as well, I know I'm bad at building things, and I am bad at Spore in general, uh, you don't need to let me know, I try my best, I mean, I, it's tough to commentate and, uh, pay attention to what I'm doing sometimes, so if I miss things, it's not me trying to be a jerk, and trying to be an ass and say, ha ha, I'm going to make them, I'm going to make them get angry about this, no, it's me genuinely missing it, because I'm trying to focus on formulating a proper sentence, I love you guys a lot. Trust me. All right, what are we doing here? Well, your basic interplanetary drive allows you to leave your planet's orbit. Sweet, I'm buying that thing. Captain, get out your spandex suit. I don't want to wear spandex. I don't look good in spandex. We're sending you on a space journey. We suspect you're not alone in this galaxy. We've picked up strange radio signals from planet Kragat in orbit and our home star. We want you to investigate. I accept. We, comm we, we, we commend you, Captain. Mission control out. 
Goodbye, mission control. Oh, upgrades. Where's my inner, inner? Ooh, a badge. You have earned the badge and title of captain. Oh, I changed the name of our captain as well to Groper the Majestic because doubling Groper just sounded very wrong. Like I'm groping you guys, and I don't want that. I don't want you to picture that because that's just bad. So I just want this plain old Groper. Oh, I forgot to name the thing as well. There's so many stuff I'm, I keep just remembering. Tools are unlocked by earning badges. I completely missed that last one. Um, once tools unlocked, you can purchase it from your home world. Some blah, 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 blah. All right, that's cool. My collections. Ooh, artifacts, badges. Those are the badges in progress. Fly to planet Kragat in the. Was that Colia Five system? Investigate the surface, so we can actually unlock things. Wow, well, there's a lot of things to unlock here. Find an empire that sells it. The minor proton mist. Okay, there's a lot. There is a. I don't know why there. Um, that some people didn't like that. Maybe it gets boring and repetitive. I think that's what people said. It looks cool so far though. Colonization. There's a lot of things. Mainly, I'm going for weapons since I'm a military guy. Um, I am not going to exit the solar system, or into the solar system yet, because I want to change the name. Um, there were a lot of really good names, and this comment got buried, but I'm going to use this one, because I thought it was, I, I had a giggle. It made me giggle, so I'm using it. So, if, actually, if you guys already seen, uh, I put UCO there, which means, if I can spell this, unident i fide cyan object There we go. That's the name of our... That's the name of our ship. UCO for short. Maybe it needs the dots in there. Can't put dots. Alright, that's fine. Do we need tags? We don't need tags. Because we don't need them. But, let's go with, let's just go with the doublings on this one. You guys are a part of this ship. I'll try and take care of it for you guys, I promise. Also, I'm going to get rid of this stupid little thing on the damn factory. It's just horrible looking. I'm going to make the factory very, very scary. I'm changing this. Look how bad that is. What was I thinking? You know, I'm redoing it. I'll do it, like, quickly. Where's that... Yes, columnar one. I like that. Factories are big. But it needs to, it needs some side cubicles as well, or it just does not make sense. I'm gonna put that there. I'm gonna... Alt... Wait, wait. Is it Alt? Copy. Put that there. Don't really know how to, like, mimic it on the other side, so if it's not perfect, I don't really care. Um... What can we use for a roof? What's, what's a very... Factory-ish looking roof. Cream topping. That's just bad. That just looks wrong. I don't like any of these. We need like a chimney stack at the top. I mean, I don't see why that's not there. So, I'm actually going to go ahead and build up one more. But I'm going to widen this one. That looks pretty dumb. But I am okay. I'm okay with that. Um, I'm gonna add a door. A door would be useful. A drawbridge. <laughs> I would love a drawbridge to get in my factory, you know? That's pretty necessary. I don't know what that thing on the bottom is. Okay, well I can get rid of the drawbridge altogether. Well, that's fine. That's gonna, that's gonna be like that. At least we have a pretty protected factory. <laughs> well, let's get some windows on here. Put some in the middle. There, and then I'll have like some little ones on the side of that. Complexity is in the top there, I believe. Put a window on the sides. I'm not going to spend a lot of time. It just looked really bad before. So I kind of want to make it a little bit better, if you guys can understand my feelings on that. Let's go with this, and what can we have for a roof that's going to look okay? It needs to... Can I, what happens when I, like, widen this one out? Whoa! That's interesting. I'm gonna go with that. I'm gonna try and have something on the back here that's, like, there. A periscope. <laughs> I'll go with that. You know, that that's just gonna go in the roof. Oh, there we go! That's perfect! Oh, that's what I'm going for! Awesome! Oh, great! Oh, wow. Wow! Wow! Oh my god, that's there. I can really go steampunk on this one. Putting that there. Wow, I feel so dumb, guys. Oh my god, I'm so mad now. I'm gonna go with this. I'm gonna copy that. Alt. Nope. Is it? Yes, it is. 
Put it on the other side. Man oh my god, what are you doing? So I... I feel pretty bad. About, like, being my... I, I, feel, I feel pretty bad as a human right now. That I didn't even know that was in there. That's really weird. It should only be on one side. Whoa! Okay, no, I want it out. But I will go ahead and try that. That's cool. Let's go with that. Can I, can I put it, like, inside there? That would be cool, because then it would look like it was, like, smoking. Doesn't look like I really can. Can I, like... Well, that itself looks like a smokestack type thing. Oh, you know what I could do? I could have, like, a... Does that spin? Oh! Wicked! That's cool! Oh, you know what I'm gonna do instead, then? I am gonna... You know what? I'll go with this. Yeah, I don't know why I got rid of it in the first place. Oh, wow. Whoa. Yeah, I was trying to I was trying to make it like there we go. Windmilly. Not like right on the front. It's gotta be sort of towards the back. And then I'm gonna have to put what are these things right here? Is that details? Alright, oh yeah, well my, I had no details. Someone's screaming outside. Steampunk mill, there we go. I'm going to that. That's gonna look way cooler. I need to have and then in, as an illusion, I need some steam coming out of this thing. Suit a soot belcher. What's that look like? Does it do anything? Oh, wow. There we go. Now it's looking factory-ish. How small can I make this so that, like, I can... Oh, yeah! Make it look like it's a big chimney! A big chimney swift. Go with that. Bam! There we go. I'm liking that. That's good. The blub blub factory. We make shit. <laughs> I completely forgot about that. So how about we go with, um... Let's go with... Wait, wait. Didn't really change much there, did it? Alright. There we go. There's our new factory. Not really that cool, but it's definitely... Oh, wow. It's, look at that. It's an improvement. <laughs> sort of. Alright. See, so like, I'm not good at building things. I know. Okay. Now let's go into space. I'm gonna fly on planet Kragnat. Do we? I'm gonna use my laser a bit. Wow. This thing's got some range. Alright. Let's fly out. Holy shit! Oh my god! Wow! Holy crap! Okay, I thought I was gonna be able to fly it right out. There's Colia 5. Who's that? That's a comet? Can I go to the comet? Oh, that's so cool! I am clicking on it. Do I have to click on the... Oh, well that... Oh, sorry. Wow, because I'm in the system, Colia 5. I thought that was like... I was about to fly into the sun. Do not trust me with a spaceship ever, please. What the hell was I just doing? Okay. Yes, yeah, so I want to go to this planet, please. And I gotta, do I gotta scroll in to uh, be able to go on it? Is that how it works? Oh, neat. Something is showing up on the ship's radar. Oh my god. What's that? Someone has crash landed, I think. There's bones. I don't think there's any survivors. It's a space. It's a crash spacecraft, and it's emitting a strange radio signal. Fly to it and use a scan tool to investigate the crash site. I will do that. So where is our scan tool? There it is. Where is this? Um. It's over here somewhere in this general direction. There it is. Scan. What is that? Who is in there? Is anyone alive? Some crazy. Ooh. What's that? Aliens! Oh, really? But no signs of life. Looks like they drew some type of cryptic map before they died. Wait! The wreck has triggered a transfer beam. Some items are coming aboard. Wait, we're getting... A what? We're getting things? Look at that X-Wing. That is badass! Woo! I'm glad I made that. We just got something. Look at that. Free shit. I'm a bandit. I am a bandit. Missiles and an interstellar drive which seems to have an unknown star's coordinates programmed into it. The wreck's damage looks like it came from a fight. This ship must have been sent from some other planet to get help. Click the right mouse button or the arrow keys to fly your spaceship. I know how to freaking fly, game. It looks like he's like pointing to a something. That's a map, isn't it? Something here to there. Lead the solar system scroll, okay. Wow. Can I not use it here? Can I try it out, like, down here? Oh, maybe it's like... Oh, it's like a targeting missile. I see. That's cool. Alright. 
left the solar system, so I'm going back to leave this solar system, really. How freaking far can I go out here? Holy shit! The interstellar drive from the wreck is responding to a beacon from a nearby star that matches the coordinates in its memory. This must be the home planet. They may still be needing help. Can I name my, uh... Where am I going here? What's that? Oh, that's my home. Am I, I'm supposed to be going up here? Fly to planet Sigulus in the system. Okay, so in the, in the Hundria system. Holy crap, look at how big... Can I actually go- What?! Holy shit! Oh my freaking- Oh my quad! Quad! Wow, this really- That is pretty intense. I- That is beautiful, really. Holy shit. Alright, let's fly down to hundred in the Hundria system. See what's going on. Is this Sigulus? Is this where I'm going? Yes, it is. Let's go down on this- Let's go down on this planet. Wow, this one's cool. It's got like red gra red and brown grass. Something is showing up on the ship's radar. This is getting repetitive, I think. This is I think that's why people don't like it. But so far it looks cool to me. <laughs> I like it. I like it. <laughs> Too late. These ruins must be what's left of the home colony of the aliens from the wreck. Scanning the ruins may reveal clues to what happened here. Sure thing, man. I am down. I am going to get down with this. Where am I going? Is it this way? There it is. Woo! <laughs> that's how I scan things. The scan came up. That's my that's my scan noise. Woo! The scan came up with nothing, but it seems to have triggered a response. Some activity is showing up on the radar. Oh shit! Whoa, what's that? It's a, is it a ship? He's got a trident ray as well. The scan must have triggered the colony's defenses. These drones don't look friendly. Wait. An incoming transmission. Warning. Grox intruders detected. All Grox intruders will be turned... Well, Grox. Initializing self-defense code. Grox 999. All Grox intruders will be terminated. We are not Grox. Warning. All Grox intruders will be... For the last time, we are not Grox. Oh, shit. Woo! Oh, yeah, you fucking guys. Suck it, bitches! I got the laser. You can't attack me. Ow! Yeah, you can. I'm a laser beam you. I'm gonna use my. I'm gonna use my missiles. Oh wow, those are way better. What's up? I'm gonna run from no. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go ahead and take some animals as well. Huh? How do you feel? Where's the damn? There it is. I can't use the. I can't use it. Oh, I can't use it. And this is all right. I'm gonna return to my home world now and complete the mission. Where, if I can find it. Travel pretty damn fast, I will say. So we're gonna go to, um, where am I? Colia 5 or something weird like that. There's my home. At least it labels it. Can I change the name of it? Because we can name our own solar system, guys. That'd be awesome if we can name it. Your SETI device has revealed strange radio signals emitting from this star. Fly in and explore. It's pretty classic y, uh, or it's pretty, uh, go here, do this, do that sort of thing. What is this down there? Ooh. Collected spice, really? How did I get that? What's this guy want? Mission accomplished. We knew we weren't alone in the galaxy. Traces of Look how big the galaxy is. Of course we're not alone. Um, hostile security drones in the Grox. It's obvious that we must continue our exploration of the galaxy and potentially prepare for the hostilities. In order to do so, we'll have to set up or we need to set up colonies are as bases of operation. Oh shit. Our scientists are already reverse engineering the interstellar drive to replicate its technology. We've also developed a SETI device. For your ship, it will pick up signals of other sentient life in the galaxy, indicated by radio signals over the stars that you target. We need you at the helm of our space program. Captain, I'm in. Fucking reading! We need to expand our empire and our wealth by building colonies on other planets for mining resources. We've drafted a few volunteers to be a part of the colony in Credipac, all right, uh, which we've placed in your colonization bin. Our astronomers have been observing the heavens and have identified a hospitable planet. Solaron. How do I establish colony? God, why did I even ask? Placing a colony is easy. After flying the planet Solaron, select the colony tool, colonization tool bin, and place the near spice geyser. It will instantly unpack. Colony. Assembly required. No assembly required. You might want to make contact with colony to make sure the citizens we packed in there unpacked safely. Oh, one more thing. What's this? 
I'd like to talk about my miss it. Alright, well, let's go. Let's do this. Place a colony on planet Solaron, uh, in Saigo, or Kygo. Si I'm gonna go with Saigo, I think. Saigo system, Saigo 2 system. Alright, let's go to that place, because that sounds fun. Use the star map filters to help navigate the galaxy. Ooh, look at these. Uh, the My Empire filter will reveal all the stars your empire currently owns. Holy shit, we can own some planets. Use the mission filter to point you to the target stars of the mission you're actively working on. The travel trail and visited filters come in handy when you want to know where you've been. Man, this is getting pretty nuts here. This is complicated. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just stupid. Probably what it is. All right, this is Saigo system, or Saigo two. Planets in green orbit paths are easier to terraform and colonize than planets on red or blue orbit paths. So I'll go for the green one then, Solaron. Z zoom in on in this on this biznatch. Holy, that is a wow! That plane looks freaking badass. 